Theo Chikamba reports. Meet Duncan. He's the man leading the success at Bottom Farm in Northamptonshire. For the first time, they've received a prestigious accolade. The Queen's Award for Enterprise, uh, which we've won the Sustainable Development category, they are the highest accolade for business awards you can get in the UK. I think there's about 200 companies that have been honoured this year, but of that there's only 17 that have had the award for sustainability. His passion for this area began 20 years ago. When I first came back to the farm in the early 1990s, I was aware of farmers and sustainability and environmentalism and birds and all the rest of it and I wasn't an expert in any of these things but I, I soon I got, became very intrigued and I've looked at trying to one improve the food we grow and the nutrition of the soils I grow it in and improve all the wildlife around the field edges and around the farm. And it's the way they produce oil which has been hailed. I've planted this rapeseed without disturbing the soil from last year and I've planted it with uh, what we call companion crops so as well as the rapeseed I planted this with something called buckwheat because that's really good at scavenging for phosphate to help the, the plant grow. It also had a clover in there which is really good at providing nitrogen for the crop. From the field the seeds make it in here. They are processed through this machinery then packaged in here. Product aside he's already looking to the future. What practical things are you doing here on the farm in terms of, you know, improving sustainability and the general environment? If I can absorb carbon dioxide through our farming practices by the sun powering the crops growing, which are sucking CO2 out of the atmosphere to make a crop that we can then eat, but also putting it down through the roots into the ground and we can lock it up in there, it's, it could, um, agriculture worldwide could reduce uh, carbon emissions by between 10 to 30%. The recognition they've received has inspired them as they do their part to make the world a better place. The Ochocomba, Bibsalakist, Northamptonshire.